Sorry, sorry, sorry. Now I'm recording. Ooh. All right, we won't repeat this one. Three, two, one, butt kicks. Heels up. Oh my God. No recording. Keep moving. Heels up, all the way up. Kick your butts. Butt kicks. Oh, I thought that was, I thought that was Norman in the camera over there. Cause I can't see the head. <laughs> Let's keep it moving. All right. I see, I see more people are joining. That's good. So this is day two. Um, it's gonna be a little bit similar like we did on Sunday. For those of you that missed Sunday, you're gonna have to wait until we start so you know what I'm talking about. Almost there. 10 seconds. Make sure you're breathing. If you don't want to hear me breathing, just put on some music over there, please. Pretty sure my voice is annoying. Three, two, one. Take a deep breath. We're going to do alternating lunges. So stepping forward, switch legs, right? Get a nice stretch there. Maybe you're sore from Sunday's leg workout. Maybe you're not. I'm a little bit sore. My inner thighs are hurting a bit. Whew. Whew. Keep it moving. Whew. Let's see how many calories we burn today. Well, I burn, so I can't. That's all up to you, depending on how much effort you put in. So, if you remember how many calories you burn on Sunday or the last day you worked out, it would be a great, great idea if you try to beat that number, even if it's by one calorie. You know, just try to push a little harder to beat that number. Three, two, one. All right, sumo squats. We're gonna go wider than shoulder width apart. And I want a little bounce at the bottom, a little pull. So it's gonna be one, two, and come up. Ready, go. All right, just push those knees out, get a nice stretch on your inner thighs. Well, good thing we're not doing legs today, right? Well, there is kind of like one leg exercise, but it's not that bad, all right? Whew. Don't forget that little bounce, get that extra stretch down there. 15 seconds. So who's here today? Stephanie, Letty, the Mehovich sisters. Mehovic, Mehovic. Three, two, one. All right, we're doing hand walkouts. So we're gonna try to keep the legs straight and hands on the floor all the way down, chest to the floor. All right, help yourself up with your hips. Keep the leg straight, keep the leg straight, push up, stand up. All right, back down again. All the way down, all the way down to the floor. Uh, keep working. Keep it moving, keep it moving, keep it moving. Just gonna open up. Some windows, you guys keep going. You still, we still got a couple of more. Oh, we got a good amount of time left. Keep going. I'll get back in it too. Make sure you got some good music in there. Not just this wonderful voice of mine. <laughs> Apparently I've been very annoying today to all my clients. Three, two, one, and up. Jumping jacks, people. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. Hands over your head. So yeah, apparently I've been very annoying to all my clients. My first client starts at 5.45 in the morning. So she comes here to get an awesome workout. But she was not in the mood today. She cursed me out around 6 a.m. <laughs> 
I know, I know they all mean love, you know? 20 seconds, keep going. Get those hands over your head. If you can't jump, you can just do side steps, all right? If you can't jump, 10 seconds. Keep it moving. Three, two, one. Take a deep, deep breath. We're gonna stretch it out. Right arm out and pull. All right, arms should be straight. Breathe. And switch. We're gonna be stretching. Keep holding it, keep holding it. I wanna take a look at the workout. Right arm across. Oh my God. Deep breaths, all right? Switch. I wonder, I hope I send the invite to everyone. Right arm over. Who are we missing here? Is it blurry? It's not blurry, right? All right, who's missing? Switch. Ooh. Deanna's missing. But well, Deanna's on vacation now. Um, head to the side. Eva, missing. There are a few people missing today. Hm. Also, when I step away, let me know if it's blurry or it's good. Because, you know, I purse stuff. Switch. So if you see that it's blurry, you're going to have to let me know. Not by sign language. All right, feet together, all the way down. Oh, my God. Everything just cracked. Make sure you tuck your chin in, take deep breaths, and slowly up. All right, left foot forward. You're gonna bend this knee, right? But the other leg is completely straight, and you're gonna reach down. Make sure it's uncomfortable, all right? That it feels uncomfortable on the back of your calves, the back of your legs, your thighs. Take deep breaths, and switch, all right? So you're gonna bend the other knee, keep that leg straight, Reach down and just breathe. Just breathe. And up, right quad. Well, I wanna say thank you to those of you, not everyone, to those of you that left me a review. Switch, very nice to read those. Switch, I don't know if I said it. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. All right. Let me tell you what we're doing, ladies and gents. All right. It's loading up. What's up? Here we go. All right. So we're going to be working on the upper body today. All right. So we're going to start off with push-ups. So we're doing, uh, so again, it's going to be the same format as Sunday. So if you were here Sunday, you would know. We're going to do three circuits. <laughs> um, so the first three exercises is going to be back to back without a break, except at the end of the third exercise, if that makes sense, right? So after we finish all three, we will. There's no workout on Sunday. You're right. I don't know what I'm talking about. I meant Monday. Monday. <laughs> all right. <laughs> There was no workout on Sunday. All right, um, so push-ups. Right after the push-ups, we're gonna work on the, uh, our backs. So we're gonna do back rows. I'm gonna show you how to do those. And then we're gonna be doing shoulder presses. All right, so if you were here Monday, you know it's gonna be three exercises, three circuits, and we're gonna start with push-ups. So let me just explain how you can do the push-ups. There's three different ways that you can do them. The easiest way would be to lay down all the way down to the floor, right? And you're going to use your hips. So you're going to have your hands aligned with your chest and you're going to use your hips to push yourself off the floor, right? And then you're going to come into your toes, down into your knees, back down, and your elbows are pointing back, all right? My elbows are not coming out. They're pointing back. So you want to keep your elbows um, along the side of your ribs, all right? And come up so that would be the easiest way because you're going to be helping out uh, helping yourself up with your hips if you want to make it a little bit more challenging for you 
All right, you are going to go on your knees, but you're not going to be up here, all right? A lot of people tend to leave the butt all the way up here, and this is what they do, right? You're not doing that. The elbows are not going out. What you're doing is you're going to bring the hips forward. See, I'm completely aligned here. So bring the hips forward, get down and up. Make sure those elbows are pointing back, all right? And you're going low enough. You're not just doing half repping. If you feel like you're just bending the elbows a little bit, that means you have to regress. You have to go in, into the hips and use the hips to come up, all right? The hardest way would be regular push-ups, all right? So it's going to be 30 seconds of regular push-ups. Right after that, we're going to get up. We're going to grab our dumbbells, slight bend on the knees. The back is completely straight, so you're sticking your chest out. You're going to tuck your chin in, tuck the elbows in, and back rows. We're going to do these for 45 seconds, all right? Both dumbbells at the same time. Then right after that, we're going to get, you can do these standing up, but if you want to make it harder, get on your knees, and we will do shoulder presses. Shoulder presses will be for 30 seconds, all right? So 30 seconds push-ups, 45 seconds back rows, 30 seconds shoulder presses, and then we take a 20-second break, all right? So let's get ready. Let's not waste time. Do, do, do. So what are we doing? Uh, okay, Rory. Dirties. Oh, geez. All right. We're ready? We're going to start with the push ups. Let's get down. All right, get ready. Three, two, one, and push ups. 30 seconds of push ups. Make sure those elbows are pointing back, right? Take your time with your push-ups. You're not rushing anywhere. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we're getting up. Let's go. You got to hurry up, hurry up. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Look at my back. Stick your chest out and pull back. 45 seconds here, all right? You choose your weight. Make sure it's challenging enough. You squeeze back here for a half a second or so. Bring it back down. Squeeze. Back down. All right. Make sure you're breathing. You're keeping that back straight. Keep pulling back. Squeeze those back muscles, right? We're almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Let's get on our knees. If you're going to do them on your knees, you can do them standing up, right? Let's get ready. Five, four, three, two, and go. 30 seconds here. seconds left. Five seconds. Three, two, one. All right. Let's take a break. 20 seconds, right? And then we're going to repeat. So we're going to be going back to the push-ups. Make sure you're ready. You're not going to waste extra time. So for the push-ups, obviously, you know, we're working out the chest. For the one that we were standing up and pulling back, we're working out the back and the biceps. Three, two, one, and go. 30 seconds. <sighs> 20 seconds left. Keep going, 10 seconds. Five, 
four, three, two, and one. All right, let's get back up. Let's go. Hey, cutie. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. Five, four, three, two, and go. So this is the one that we work in the back muscles and your biceps, your forearms, even your core. Because if you keep your back straight, when the weight is hanging, it's making you engage your core so you don't round your back. 20 seconds left. Make sure you're squeezing in the back, right? Make sure you're breathing also. Don't hold your breath. 10 seconds. We're almost there. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Get one more in. Three, two, and one. All right. Back down. We'll stay ready. Five, four, three, two, and go. Whew. Let's go, let's go. All the way up. Almost there. 10 seconds. Oh God. Keep going. Keep going. Don't stop. Just because I stopped doesn't mean you stop. You got more time. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh. All right. Get some water if you can. We have one more round left. You were here Monday, not Sunday, Monday. By the way, Hope everyone had a nice Easter. I know I said that on Monday, but for those of you that are here today. Let's go. All right, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Let's go, come on, push. This is your last round. Remember, if you're out of breath and you can't keep going, Count to five, count to 10, whatever it is. Catch your breath and get back in. You can even just get one more rep in, all right? Five, four, three, two, one. Woo. All right, let's get back up. Come on, up, 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 hurry up. Five, four, three, two, one. And we're going, go. Pull and squeeze on top, right? Tuck that chin in. You want your spine to be nice and straight, your back straight. Do not round your back. Jeez. Squeeze those back muscles. 15 seconds. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. Oh, God. Jesus. Oh, my God. All right, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Come on. 30 seconds. All the way to the top. Extend your arms to the top. Pretend you're punching the ceiling. <sighs> Pretend you're punching me. I'm up there. <sighs> <sighs> keep going. <sighs> oh, Jesus. Keep going, keep going. <sighs> Five seconds. Get two more in, two more. One and two. Time. <sighs> Take a break. Now we get a minute break. <sighs> So while we're taking this break, I'm going to tell you what we're doing next. <sighs> All right. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <sighs> All right. So we're working on four exercises. 
we're going to start with frontal races. So light dumbbells. You're going to keep your chest up. Bring them shoulder height. Back down. All right. Up and down. That easy. 30 seconds. Right. But you're keeping that chest up. Your shoulder blades are back. Right. Shoulder blades back. Chest up. And you're going to be controlling every single movement. Keep the arms completely straight. Okay. Then right after that, we're going to plank. We're going to get into a forearm plank. Forearm plank is this. Let me just show you as I go. So, make sure your elbow is right under your shoulder here, like this. Keep those hips down, squeeze your abs when you're here. All right? Now, you don't want to be like this. My back is arching. You see that? There's a big difference. All right? You want to squeeze your abs like someone is going to punch you there. Now, if you can't do those, what you can do is get on your knees, bring the hips forward, and then hold the um, the plank here. That would be a modified plank, right? Now, we're going to do that plank for 45 seconds. Right after that, we're going to do kickbacks, which is sort of like half a burpee. I know we did burpees on Monday, but today is going to be half a burpee. We don't have to go all the way down. So we are um, going wider on your legs, wider than shoulder width apart, right? So right here, I'm wide. You're going straight down, kick back, that's it. You come right back up and stand up. Take your time with it. Now, if you can't do that, you can't kick back. So what you're gonna do is this, go down, one leg back, then the other, stay straight, bring the other leg up, boom, boom. That would be the modified version of it, okay? Then, right after that, we're gonna grab those dumbbells. We are going to tuck the elbows into your ribs. So there is a slight bend on my elbows, as you can see, right? My arms are not all the way down, slight bent, elbows are tucked in, and we're gonna be doing bicep curls, okay? Tuck them in, right? We don't wanna do this, we're not gonna be swinging dumbbells here, okay? Now, the bicep curls are all are 30 seconds, all right? Let me get a pair of dumbbells that I could possibly, hopefully handle. All right, we ready? This should be, oh, I need another pair. So sorry, guys. Just give me a second. I'm gonna go light here. All right, we're gonna go a little bit heavier. All right, so today I'm using 12s for the frontal. So we're starting with the frontal races. 30 seconds, all right? Ready? Three, two, one, and go. Chest up, shoulder blades back. I wanna see myself. Keep that chest up. And remember, you're controlling every movement. Your shoulder blades are back as you lift and slowly bring it back down. 15 seconds left. Control, 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 control. If you have shoulder issues, make sure you're going light on this. If you feel any pinching or very bad pain, just stop. Three, two, one. Take a, uh, we're gonna get back, uh, we're gonna get into the plank, sorry. I was gonna say take a breather. Into the plank, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. 45 seconds, squeeze those abs, all right? Make sure you're breathing. Do not look at your feet, don't look at your feet. Make sure those elbows are right under your shoulders. Ooh, yo, yo. Hold it, don't drop. If you drop, just take a breather and get back on it. 15 seconds left. Don't arch your back, do not arch your back. You're almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, let's stand up. Let's do those half burpees. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one, and go. We're doing these for 45 seconds. Make sure you don't go all the way down. Stand up. You don't have to uh, jump. Make sure you're coming up with those uh, legs um, wide. 
wider than your hands. Stand up nice and straight. 30 seconds left. Take your time. You're working your core here. You're working the shoulders. And cardio with your heart. 15 seconds. Take your time. As you can see, I'm not rushing like I was rushing with the burpees. I honestly thought I was going to have a heart attack. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Let's get those bicep curls, right? We're tucking the elbows in. Ready? Three, two, one, and go. All the way down. Tuck those elbows in. Only 30 seconds. Try to get as many repetitions as you can. Obviously, right? That's why this is time frame. You try to do as much as you can within the time that I'm giving you. Five seconds. Three, two, one. And time. We do get a break. I don't think I mentioned that part. I always forget about the breaks. Whew. Well, it's hot in here. Couple of more seconds. Get ready. Where's Junior? I don't see him. All right, let's get it. Okay, frontal races in five, four, three, two, one, and go. Remember, you're controlling the weight on the way up and on the way down. I don't want you to just drop it, right? We don't want to do what I just did. You want to slowly up, slowly down. You want to control all the movements. Because when you let it drop, you're not doing anything. And we want to do everything. Five, four, three, two, one. Whoo! All right, to the plank, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Plank and hold it, hold it, squeeze your abs. Make sure you're breathing. Woohoo! This is, oh, I feel it in my shoulders. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh man. Whew. Let's work our way up. Come on, let's get up. Let's get up, let's get up, let's get up. Five. We know what we're doing. Three, two, one, and go. Take your time with it, right? Remember, you don't have to go all the way down. Stand up straight. Make sure you're kicking back. Whew. My shoulders. I don't know if you're feeling it, but even with this move, you should still feel it on your, on your shoulders, on your deltoids, too. That was an inside joke. Oh, my God. Let's keep going. 15 seconds. Whew. 10 seconds. Come on. We got time for one more. One more. One more. And time. Whew. Bicep curls. Let's go. Come on. Five. Hurry up. Three, two, one, and go. Remember, tuck the elbows in. Woo! Oh man, I'm struggling. 
you should be struggling too, right? Should be challenging for you. Make sure you got the right weight that are making uh, that are making you work. Almost there. Three, two, one. Oh, jeez. What's next? Break is next. That's what's next. Whew. The struggle is real. <laughs> Make sure you're pushing, right? You're getting out of breath. Let's see the calorie count right now. 267. So I'm, I am, uh, what is it going to uh, say? Uh, what is it? Oh my God, I'm like speaking Spanish and English mixed with uh, some other language. Uh -huh. I'm, I'm going to guess, I think we're going to get hit 500. Well, I'm going to hit 500. You better be pushing too. All right, let's get ready. Frontal races. Three, two, one, and go. Remember, control it on the way down, control it on the way up. You're now rocking your body. We're almost there. Five, four, three, two, one, 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 one. Ready? Plank. Let's go. Come on. Five, four, three, two, go. Remember, you don't have to wait for me. You're already down and you want to get started. You're more than welcome to start. Obviously, you can wait for the countdown or you can go after the countdown until you, you know, catch your breath and you're able to get back in it. Make sure you are breathing on your plank. This is really, really killing my shoulders. Come on, Roy, hold it. My shoulders hurt more than my abs right now. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Damn. Whew. All right. Back up. Let's go. Half burpees. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Come on, let's push it. Let's go, let's go. This is our last round. Remember, it's working out. Your abs right here. Woo! Let's go. Come on. Ah. Woo! Keep it going. Whew. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah. I'm dead. Ah. Ah. Ten seconds. Whew. Five seconds. We could get two more. Come on. One more after this one. One more, one more. Get it. Three, two, one. Whew. <coughs> <coughs> Whew. That's just a regular cough, okay? That's just a dry throat right there. <coughs> Ready? Come on. Buy some curls. Three, two, one. Let's go. Let's go. Whew. I just need water. <laughs> I have to explain my cough before I get judged. Keep going. We're almost there. Five, four, three, two. Oh man, I can't. One. Get some water. Take a deep breath. That's it, right? Okay, good. <laughs> it's 
So, I've been very good with my water intake. I hope you guys are drinking enough water. A lot of us, most people don't. The moment you feel like you're thirsty or the moment you feel like your lips are dry, that automatically means you're already dehydrated. So, you're not getting enough water in, just so you know. The only downside of this is the more you drink, the more you gotta go pee, which is annoying, especially when you're working. Whew. Anyways, here we go. All right, four exercises, three rounds, okay? And I'm gonna show you what we're doing. All right, boom, 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 boom. All right, so this is called, we've done these before, but probably not in a circuit. So these are called back flies. We're gonna get in the same position as the back rows, right? The back is straight. Dumbbells are here. You have to go light here, right? So this is the position you're in. Arms completely straight, right? Now, these are the back flies. Then you're doing the Y's. So meaning like the letter Y, you're gonna come up this way, boom. Right, so your dumbbells have to be very light. So we're going into fly and Y, okay? We're gonna do this for 30 seconds, so it's not much. Right after that, we're gonna do a little quote unquote boxing, which we're gonna be moving, we're gonna be jumping up and down, and then we're just gonna be moving our arms, you know. Well, we wanna punch, punch. But basically, this is all we're doing, and we're doing these for 45 seconds. So that is going to get your heart rate up. Then, right after that, we're gonna do uh, plank jacks. That's gonna take 30 seconds. So plank jacks are, you're gonna be on your hands, and I'm gonna show you two ways to do them. So basically, I don't know what would be the best way to show you. So I'm gonna face that way, so you can see the plank jacks. So you get into a plank position, right? So you will be in a plank position, but now I'm gonna show you what you do with your legs. So plank position and in and out, right? So you're jumping. Now, if you can't do that, what you can do is, I'm sorry, I know, don't look here. <laughs> if you can't do that, what you're gonna do is take a step to the side, take a step to the side. Now, if that continues to be too difficult for you, sorry for the view, you can stand up, and instead, you can do um, side steps, all right? And just do the side steps for 30 seconds. You wanna make it a little harder, just jump with it, right? Okay, and then right after that. You're gonna get on your knees and you're gonna hold the dumbbells this way. So before we were holding them out, palms facing forward, now we're gonna be here. And we're gonna alternate all the way up. So you're punching up. So try to punch up, bring it back down, all the way down, punch up again, all right? Punch up again. So it's a shoulder press, uh, isolated shoulder press. So you work in the back of your arms, right? If it's saggy back here, this is what you want to do. And that's what we're doing, all right? And we're doing those for 45 seconds. All right? Let's get it. Do you remember the first exercise? No, you don't. So is here, fly, Y. All right? Let's get it. I'm going light. I'm taking 12s on these. Ready? Three, two, one. One and go. Fly. Ooh. Why? Jesus, you really have to go light here. So, if you only have heavy dumbbells, probably just do. Uh, I don't even know what to tell you. <laughs> uh, if you have very heavy dumbbells, mm, you should just do the Y portion with one dumbbell instead, right? I'll show you in the next round. Keep going. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, before we move on to the next one, if your dumbbells are very heavy, right, what I want you to do is, sorry I didn't say this before, just hold one dumbbell and do forward, okay? If your dumbbells are too heavy, you can't do uh, the fly. All right, what are we doing next? The boxing, ready? Three, two, one, we're jumping and just punching, right? 45 seconds, get your heart rate up. Right? You're jumping, right? You're bouncing. Bounce. 
Pretend you're fighting me. Let's go. One on one. <laughs> so, you see that guy in the middle of the screen? <sighs> he used to kick my butt when we were little. An abusive older brother. <sighs> Woo, keep going. Well, when we were growing up in Panama, we will wrap towels around our hands. Now, he is four years older than me, four. So, I was raised, you know? I'll go toe to toe with him and get my butt kicked every time. <laughs> almost there, almost there. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Woo! Plank jacks. This is more cardio and abs. A lot of abs. Ready, ready, ready. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Yeah. You know, he used to kick my butt all the time. I remember my mother saying, if you're going to play like this, you're going to end up fighting for real. And she was always right. We would start playing, and then it would turn into a real fight where I would lose all the time. Almost there. Woo, my shoulders, my shoulders. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo. All right. We're punching the air. You remember that one, right? On your knees. Here. Ready? Three, two, one. Alternating. Boom. All the way up. Go strong. All the way up, and you control it slowly on the way down. Just make sure you don't snap. Your elbows, they're right here, right in front. You're not going out, you're going up in front. Try to keep your elbows in front of you. Oh, my shoulder. Woo, keep going. Day two, come on. Almost there. Punch it, punch it. All the way up, extend that arm. Five, four, three, two, one. Hey, Vincent. Woo, time. We got a break, right? We got a break. Yes, we do. We got a break. Shoulders. You hear me complaining a lot? My shoulders are my weakest area. Aside from my abs. I think I'm too honest. I shouldn't be saying these things. What's weak, what's not? I gotta look good. I gotta pretend I'm extra strong since I'm the trainer. All right, let's go. Into the flies, into the whys, right? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Whew. Three, two, one, and make it look pretty. Come on. Control it, right? A lot of control there. Fifteen seconds. I don't know about you guys, but everything is cracking with this shoulder exercise. Three, two, one. Woo. Woo. Ready? What are we up to? Boxing. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. Get in there. Boom, 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 boom. Be sure you're jumping, all right? Get a nice bounce in there. Get your heart rate up. Punch. So if someone upset you today, think about that person, not me, somebody else. <laughs> Let the frustrations out. Especially if you can't hit the person because you work with them, you know? I'm sure you got one of those at work. 10 seconds. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Whew. 
that gets me out of ooh, 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 ooh. plank jacks ready get down five come on three two one and go we're bouncing bounce bounce come on keep your hips down you're not twerking i always say that this is not a twerking exercise Got to keep the hips down. Keep going. Woo! Almost there, almost there. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Oh, man. Deep breath. Breathe, breathe, breathe. All right. Last punch the ceiling. Ready? Three. Two, one, go. Elbows in front, all the way up. All the way up. Come on, let's go. Straight up. Elbows in front of you, elbows in front of you. Come on, keep going. Let's keep going. We're almost there. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Help. We're doing good. Oh, 413 calories. Woo! We're going to make 500, whatever number you are. So if you are at 300, try to aim to 325, 330. If you are at one, uh, whatever number you are, 250. Try to go to 270, right? We got 10 minutes. We could put in some work in there. All right. We have one more round. Let's get ready. Come on. Let's go. You got to get your heart rate up. That way you burn more calories. So whenever we have this uh cardio sections that's where you gotta burn it out ready three two one and go keep going Keep going, keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Boxing. Come on. Last round. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. 45 seconds. Come on. Get it in there. Get your heart rate up. Quick, quick. Come on. Jump, make sure you're jumping. Got a nice little bounce in there. Boom, boom. You can do different uh, punches, but I prefer the straights so you can get more in. You can do the hooks and all that. Keep moving. Bounce in there. Jesus. If I was fighting an actual person, I would be getting my butt kicked right now. Because my arms are so weak. Keep going. 10 seconds, five, four, three, two, one, Woo! Ay, ay, ay. plank jacks, let's go, get down, I almost fell, nobody saw that, good, deep breath, last round, let's make it happen, three, two, one, Let's go. Boom. Come on. Let's try to finish without dropping. Woo! Which is going to be very, very difficult. 15 seconds. Breathe, right? You're breathing. Don't hold your breath. We're almost there. 
five, four, three, two, one. Oh man, that is not cool at all. I don't know what I was thinking when I came up with this workout. I was thinking upper body. Let's go, let's go. We're ready? Last one. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Elbows in front, punch up. Come on, punch. It's all about punching today. That way you don't kill no one tomorrow at work. Or at home. I wonder how many times Grace thought about either poisoning me or <laughs> kicking my butt. I wonder, whew, let's keep going. I'm just trying to get your mind out of, the, out of the exercise. I wonder what you ladies think when your partner does something dumb, like really dumb, like, do you want to hit him? <laughs> like, beat him up? <sighs> We're almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Because we do some dumb things. Whew. What's next? Oh, that's it. It's break time. Whew. All right. We have two exercises left. Two exercises left. And it's just going to be a little bit of, you know, extra work for the... For the abs, um, stretch a little bit, you know, just to, we're gonna get the, the ab work in there. So it's two exercises, and we're doing three sets, and we're gonna try to do it without a break. Jesus Christ, I have sweat in my eyes. So we're gonna go with Russian twist. If you don't know what a Russian twist is, you're gonna lean back, so you're gonna sit, bend the knees, Lean back. Once you feel that tension that your body is holding you from falling back, and you're squeezing your abs, that's where you want to be. And then place your hands together. You don't have to, but keep them close. You have to, you're going to rotate. Bring that shoulder across your body. Your hands try to touch right behind your hips. So right here, boom, and turn. Do you see my head? It's facing to the wall, facing to the camera, right? So get that rotation in. Right after that, Definitely my favorite for abs. We're gonna place our hands under our hips, legs completely straight, and we're just gonna do like races. We're doing both for 30 seconds. All right, ready? Let's go, breaks up, Russian twist. You don't need to wait for this. If you're gonna use the weight, you have to move slowly. I don't want you to rush because momentum will carry you. Ready, three, two, one, and go. 30 seconds. So back to my story of how we do dumb things. Just Sunday, Easter, I have family over, friends. For some reason, I decided, well, I took the skin off the salmon that I was grilling. Now that skin was gonna be for my dogs, or for the dogs. And we're almost there. Three, two, one. All right, lay on your backs. Place your hands under your hips. Ready? Three, two, and go. All right, on the next round, you're not going to wait for a countdown. We're just going to transition right away into the next move. So back to my story while we suffer here. So I left the skin of the salmon on the grill while I was still grilling, right? I had a few things in there. My parents came into the house and I wanted to show them something. It literally took like a minute and a half. I left the grill by itself. The whole thing was on fire. <laughs> I mean like the fence was melting. I'm not exaggerating. It really it melted, it dented. Five, four, three, two, one. You should be feeling this on your lower back, right? Ready? Let's go. The lower back is part of your core. If you didn't know, now you know. That's Biggie right there. Ready? Go. <laughs> baby, baby. 
But yeah, you know what's the funniest thing about this? Burning, because I almost burned the neighbor's house down, and not worse. My brother saw the fire, and this guy opens up the grill. The flames, I, I think the flames are like on his face, and he's casually just worried about the salmon, moving the salmon out of the, the way. I get there, and I see, like, the, I have bread in there, too. The bread was, like, completely black. And he's like, don't worry about the bread. The salmon is more expensive. <laughs> so I was like, it's like, I'm worried about the house. Five, four, three, two, one. Whew. Whew. Ready? And go. Right away. We're not waiting. But yeah. So how dumb was that? I just, you know, have the grill on, full blown fire, and I just leave it by itself. I wonder what Grace was thinking at that moment. <laughs> she probably just looked at me and, and shook her head. Uh, I'm smart for some things, but not everything, okay? I'm not perfect. <laughs> Almost there. Five, four, Three, two, and one. We have one round left. All right, let's finish strong. Ready? Take a deep breath, deep breath. Ready, ready, ready? Five, three, two, go. Let's go. Last one. Come on, last one. Last one. Let's try to do it. My lower back is killing me. It feels tight. We're going to do a little bit of stretching for that part when we finish the class. For those of you that are new, we also stretch at the end of class. Woo! Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Let's get into the leg races. Ready? And go. If you're struggling right about now, just keep telling yourself one more. Seriously, it, it works. Just tell yourself in your head, one more, one more, and push to get that one more in. Let's keep going. Oh, Jesus. We're almost there. Try to keep your legs as straight as possible. Five, four, three, two, one. Ooh, take a deep breath. <sighs> lay down, lay down. We're going to stretch from here, right from this position. You're going to have, take a deep breath, take a deep breath. You're going to have one leg straight on the floor. And you can see I have one knee up. So what you're going to do is you're going to place your hands on the floor. You're going to get that knee across your body, your head. Hold on, let me just move my mic. <sighs> your head is going to go the opposite way. So the knee goes to the right or whichever knee you have and then your head just goes to the opposite side. You can use your hand to bring that knee lower if you need it, but just take a deep breath while you're there. All right, switch. Oh, God. Breathe, breathe. All right, relax. Now, you're gonna bring one knee to your chest. All right, bring that knee to the chest. Guess how many calories I got in? 512, and we're still stretching. So the great thing about, and switch, about high intensity workouts is that even after you are done working out, your body continues to burn calories at a higher rate. So you're burning more calories as if, like if you didn't work out, your, your body will, all right, relax. Your body will burn calories at a slower pace. But now that your heart is going, you could probably burn a good, pretty good amount an hour after your workout. All right, so now legs apart. You're going to try to go as wide as you can, right? If this is hurting here, quads, means you're very tight in this area. You can't be sitting like this. All right, so you're going to keep your legs completely straight, right? You see my toes are pointing towards me. And now I'm reaching down. As low as I can, you want to tuck your, your chin in. 
Take a deep breath. Think about the ocean. <laughs> That's my yoga voice. All right. Relax. Take a deep breath and reach down to your leg with the opposite hand. You have to make it uncomfortable. It's not just about grabbing it. Like I can grab it here and I don't feel anything. So I actually got to bring myself lower so that I can feel it. And you want to feel it on your calves and the back of your thighs. All right. And switch. All right. Relax. Now legs together in front of you. I don't know if you can see that. Probably not, but feet together. We'll do it this way. And reach down. Reach down. Again, keep the legs complete.